That is right, guys. We have a brand new Yeezy. I've been waiting for this thing for a while, so I'm pretty excited to get this thing open. As you read in the title, this is the Yeezy Cinder. Let's go ahead and get it open. Now, these are from Adidas. We got them for retail. We won the little raffle thing or whatever. And for some reason, they came out a day earlier for the Adidas raffle. And it took about like three days longer for these to come. When Adidas ships them, it usually only takes like two or three days, but this time it took a whole week. It probably has something to do with everything that's going on in our world right now. Here you go, guys. 350. Now, when you order these off of the Adidas website, they usually don't have any like paper inside or anything, but when you order them off like East Bay or something, they usually have some type of like order form or something like that. Okay, so the only thing that comes in the box is another box with the Yeezys inside, hopefully. So, yep, got the tag. I did order a nine and a half this time. Uh, I usually get tens. Yeah, well, this is a nine and a half. This is my first Yeezy I've ever bought, but and if you are Ordering a Yeezy for the first time I would suggest going a half size up and then taking out the insole that just works for me I'm a nine and an NMD and a nine and a half without the insole is fine And then I can also wear a 10, but it's kind of loose on me So I would just do a half size up, but let's go ahead and get this opened Okay, well, got the paper, always. Now, here's the left shoe right here. Now, they did change up the stitching on these. So, it's like more of just like straight up instead of across. You know, it doesn't look that bad. I like this better in hand than in pictures. That's what I like. In hand, or in pictures, you could, like, you couldn't really tell what color the top is. It's more of a, like, a, a brownish grayish. And, like, I know a lot of people say this, they're like, oh, it goes, like, with the cinder theme. But, yes, it actually does. And this is more of a matte gray. You know, it's not the regular Yeezy, like, uh, what soul. I don't know, it just seems more of a matte color. And then, you know, you got the brown. Let's take these out so we can reshape the shoe. Jeez, these are so tight. I don't know why. They, like, lost their form with all the packaging. Okay, so... Yeah, that's pretty much the unboxing of these, and if you're interested in picking up a pair of these, you can check out StockX or GOAT, and yeah, so something else about the shoe, it's got the, the translucent, translucent stripe right here, but if you wear a different color sock, you can't really see it because it's basically black or that brown color. I don't know, but it's got the pull tab and then, you know, the black all the way through the dash of yellow, which I really like. And then here, let's, let's take out the insole. Okay. So, hmm. hold up. Never mind. I thought the insole seemed deeper than regular ones, but no, they're the same. But yeah, it says Adidas in white right there, just like the Oreos. Yeah, I don't see anything different on the inside. Yeah, overall, a really nice shoe. I would recommend buying it if you want something sleek and nice, like something that's not really that crazy. And make sure you subscribe because I am doing a sneaker giveaway when I hit 1,000 subscribers. So you don't want to miss out on that. And drop a like on this video and tell me in the comments if you grabbed a pair of these and if you like them or if you don't like them. But as always, thank you guys for watching.